aka Mazadona 10, aka the Cookie Monster, and I am going to run you through every week the new Cookie League, where I'll be going through the best cookies that Britain has to offer from all the leading supermarkets and other retailers, looking at Subway, Co op, Lidl, Asda, Morrison's, etc. So there's going to be a few ratings. We're going to be going on price, we're going to go on weight, and we're going to go on taste. So there's going to be three independent tasters. It's going to be myself, Dan the Man Evans, and Lid the Flair Bowie. So we'll all be giving a rating out of 10 every day uh, when we try a new cookie. And then we'll put them in the league to see which cookie is the best. So this week we have the Belgian milk chocolate cookies from the court, uh, £1.75. So we'll give these a try now and we'll let you know how we get on. If you enjoy these videos then make sure you like, subscribe and post below what you'd like us to try and uh, maybe we can give that a go in the future. Okay, so here we've got the Belgian milk chocolate cookie. So this will be number one. Here it is. Um, looks pretty decent. A lot of chocolate chunks in the middle. A um, bit burnt around the edge. Um, let's have a look. See, a lot of the chocolate chimps are, uh, seem to be on the one side as opposed to the other. So I'll, uh, I'll give it a try. It's nice, doesn't feel overly luxury. Um, chocolate's nice, the biscuit is a bit, a little bit dry, I'd say. Over a big middle bite here. Um, nice and soft in the middle, doesn't blow me away though. Almost tastes like somebody's baked them at home and brought them in. So it's not, not a professional cookie. Thinking probably probably a six for this one. Hey everyone, uh, finished the co-op one, scores weren't great, um, scored average of 5.3 overall, myself gave it a 6, Lydia 4, Dan 4.8 and we had a guest judge which gave us 6.3, so um, today we've got Tesco Finest Triple Chocolate, I know it's uh, backwards but just there so you can see, so it's 1.54, feel a bit heavier as well. In the original ones, so I'm just going to give it a try now. Oh, broken off a bit. It's nice, uh, nice and soft. Should be a bit thicker, if I'm honest. Um, um, with a few more chocolate chunks I'd say. Um, it's nice. Um, not the best cookie I've ever had. Um, certainly pleasing. Um, so on reflection, uh, the Tesco cookies, I think I am going to give it a 7.5. It was uh, much more enjoyable than the one from Co-op. Yeah, and apparently the surgeon found a whole Toblerone up there. Oh, hi everyone, uh, Matthew Jones here, the Cookie Monster. Uh, day three of the Cookie Challenge. Yesterday we had the Tesco triple chocolate ones, which scored a much better rate in around 7.5 over the co-op ones on the first day. Um, so after today ones, I'll put up the current league stand-in showing all the vital stats. And today we have another triple chocolate, but this one, the one from Morrison's. 5p more expensive, so I'll give those a try and I'll um, do my rating. Okay, so there's the cookie if you want to have a, a look. Quite an odd shape, a bit like a, a skull or something like that. It's quite crumbly.
much more like a cookie than um, the one yesterday. It was a bit, bit too soft, a bit more like a brownie. And I'd say the chocolate is um, much nicer, and yeah, but a bit cocoa y. Finish up and confirm the rating. So I just finished the cooking out. Um, really enjoyed it. Nice, nice texture. Um, more like a cookie than yesterday's, which was still nice. Uh, I think I'm gonna give this one a 8.1. So I'll publish all the uh, all the latest readings, and uh, you can have a look at those and see the standards. So here is the first league table, and as you can see, in number one position is the Morrison's Triple Chocolate. There's a few categories on there. So there's the price per cookie, there's the average weight of the cookie, and then there's the ratings, uh, with the average rating deciding who is on the top spot. Um, coming up in second then is the Tesco Triple Chocolate Cookie with a 7.57, and in third we've got the Co-op Milk Chocolate with a disappointing 5.27. There is another rating system just on the outside, which I've got with us, the Super Cookie Rating. I'll uh, go into that in a bit more detail uh, later on and how that's worked out.